Some Puerto Ricans have been getting letters like this, where an investor buys their whole building and tells them they have to move out because he wants to do something more profitable with the building. I know this because I've interviewed them. This is a woman in her 70s who was hoping to spend the rest of her days in the apartment she was living in her town, but she had to move out after an investor bought the building, and then she had a hard time finding a place she could afford. And it's just that some Puerto Ricans cannot compete with the money coming in. In this article from the New York Times, they interviewed a man who owns his house. He was mowing the lawn in front of his house and he pretended to be a gardener when investors came up to him because he gets harassed so much to sell his house. He says they give him a blank check and tell him to write whatever he wants on it. And when I make these videos, some of you tell me this is happening everywhere. But imagine that on top of that, in your state, a law passed that gave a tax break only to people moving in. That didn't apply to you who was born there and has been living there.